Go free to turn some. Good morning, fruit bats. So we have the same smoothie as usual, except we've got some chuck raspberry drops. They are very nice. Got coconut sugar, and we've got the dates, 30 dates. Let's blend. Okay, chuck raspberry smoothie. Try it, as I always say. I want you to try it because then you understand why I get so excited. It's beautiful, especially if you're craving chocolate or something. Have a chuck raspberry daterade. Okay, so I'm just about to blend this smoothie up. I've got dates and I've got water and I put a tiny bit of coconut milk in there. It went a little bit strange. We'll see how that tastes. It's a bit of an experiment. Something different. All right, let's blend up. Okay, and this is a frothy creation that we've got. That looks amazing. Let me taste. Ooh, that's a little bit special. Very, very nice. Okay, I'm gonna enjoy this. Hey Fruit Bats, it's Frilly Banana Girl here and it's Durian Rider, little fluff dog. Say hello, say hello to the Fruit Bats. Gun show. There's not much of a gun show there, Dom. Don't need license for these guns. <laughs> Unlicensed guns. So, today, today we are gonna talk about being a skinny bitch because I've got an email here from from a nice person who asks, you are such an inspiration to me, well, says, you are such an inspiration to me, freely, I need to lose a ton of weight, but I don't know how much to eat. I want to be a skinny bitch like you, lol, jokes, but seriously, I do, please help. Figsy. What are you doing? What's this to be like a child. Bitch. He's like a little eight-year-old. Well, ADHD, I don't have no, ADHD. I don't have no Ritalin today. So, how be a skinny bitch? So, how yeah. many calories to eat? How many calories? Eat as much as you want. Eat as much as you want, but you've got to make sure they're the right calories. I'm not talking about animal products. I'm not talking about fatty food. Well, I'm talking fats. about carbs. Not all calories are created equal. A lot of people are like, oh, just, you know, just restrict your, your calories and you'll be fine. You know, what? all calories are the same. Doesn't matter what you eat. One of the obese person the other day told our friend that the brain needs lots of fats because the brain's made of fats. So our obese friend told our skinny friend um, that... Fats essential for the brain. The body yep. actually makes fat. Animal fats. I've heard that before. That lamb is essential. Lamb fat is essential for brain function. I'm like, ah, oh, what sort of world are we living in? We're all Asians it's are crazy. smart. We're all Asians are smart as fuck and make all these computers and don't even eat lean. They got noodles eat as, and rice. To be a skinny bitch, you gotta eat as much as you want. Yeah. You know, you gotta eat as much as you want. Like when your appetite comes up, you need to honor that appetite. Every time you restrict your calories, every time you say no to your appetite, you fuck your metabolism. Yeah, you do damage to your metabolism. Metabolic damage. The body likes calorie certainty. Okay, you just gotta give it the right calories. And then in time, it's gonna accumulate, the results gonna accumulate, accumulate, having all this high carb food, all this beautiful, luscious, high carb plant food. It's gonna accumulate and you're gonna go. It'll suck in. <laughs> That's too good. Okay, you don't wanna go there. But... <laughs> Slim. You'd be slim yeah. and healthy once you starve yourself. You want to look after metabolism. Yeah. A lot of people go, oh, I can't do that and I'm gaining all weight. So yeah, because you've got, you got metabolic damage. If you're eating slimming foods and you're gaining weight, you fucking need it to because yeah. you had anorexia or calorie restriction. Well, well, people come to this lifestyle and they're like this. They're like a yo-yo with their weight. You know, they're doing the paleo diet and they're calorie restricting. They're up and down. They're you know, doing all sorts of weight loss drugs and stuff like that. Not everybody, but some people and caffeine and a whole lot of drugs. Then they hit this lifestyle, they expect to just go down, but they stop doing all those things that kept off their weight to begin mm. with. You know, they stop doing the weight loss drugs that were holding off that weight. They stop calorie restriction. And then all of a sudden, poof, they gain a bit of weight. You know, it's pretty like, it's easy to work. And out, even if you're playing on it, plenty of raw food girls out there who are eating very well, but they do juice fasting and watermelon. Well, that's calorie restriction. It's calorie restriction. Yeah. And then they wonder when they gain the weight. They get angry at us. I'm just like, hey, we don't, we're not coaching you. How are you getting angry at us? What's going on with the light there? Oh, there we go. Hey, hey. It's the aura, the prana. Yeah. So, bottom line, eat as much as you want. Don't eat more than you can lift. Don't eat more than you can lift. That's not bad. Well, a lot of people out. say, oh, you know, like, you know, calorie cramming. You're making people, you're force feeding them. 
you got to remember, folks, we're just here to help. You know, we're, we're, we're showing you what has worked for us and has worked for a lot of other people. We're showing you the blueprint and we just want to see you succeed. We really, really do. That's basically it. For sure. It's I like, mean, we might fuck around and joke around, but at the end of the day... We want to see you happy and carved up. It feels so good to be carved up. It feels feel so cool. amazing. That's feel pretty cool. You know, like, the, oh, just... I, I do not miss being fatted out all I don't the time. miss being like, hungry. Yeah, and hungry. Starving. How much does that suck? Having cups of coffee oh. and some eating. I'm just like, man. I was in the cafe the other day getting a water bottle filled up, and these two girls next to me, you know, overweight. Doesn't make them bad people, but they're overweight. Physiological assessment there, and then one's going, oh, what should I eat? I'll just have a little bit of that, you know, and I'll have extra coffee. And I'm just thinking, yeah, you got to do that. And when you're my age, love, you've got to be like 400 pounds because you're Everything. training yourself to be a fat storer. Everything's about calorie restriction. All the diets out there, you name me one diet. Paleo diet, primal diet. All about calorie restriction. That's when you know it's a fat diet. It's when like you're, fat. Yeah, when your calories are restricted. You don't want to do that anymore. You want to get out of that bullshit cycle. Where is the calorie get restriction? Get on the bananas. Get on the bananas, Look, mate. Get on the bananas. Get on the bananas. <laughs> You can get on banana later on after the video is off. Uh, you want to carve up. There's no cow restriction model in nature. That's right. Animals eat as much as they care for until they're full and satisfied. And then they move on. So eat as much. Don't. You can't eat too much on this lifestyle because you physically will have to like spew up. That's right. So it's, like, it's like peeing too much. You can't pee your bladder out. If you've got an appetite, that means you need to feed it's, your brain. You it need smells to eat. good, it tastes good. Eat, you need to Honor eat. Honor your appetite. Eat it, your favourite foods every meal. It's just, yeah, it's just about making the right decision in that moment. And what people do is they restrict the carbs, they restrict the carbs, they restrict the carbs. They're like, oh, this is working, I'm losing weight. And then, bang, they hit a binge. Massive binge because they're starving. The brain's going, give me some fuel, I can't take this anymore. And then they binge out. So the best idea is to just... Eat as much as you care for of the right calories so then in time you'll get to that place you want to be. And focus on health and healing and fitness. you got to shift that focus. If you keep focusing on weight, 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 scales. Oh my God, the scale says I'm fat. Fuck the scales. I'm, I'm a bad person. Fuck the I scales. I hate myself. You know, don't yes, worry about fuck that the scales. Get them out. I told you not to swear in this one. I, I actually said, can you just keep the swearing a bit chill? And I think you put a lot of... A lot of effort into that one then. I said fruck the scales, <laughs> like fructose. Yeah, Fructose yeah, yeah, yeah. is good. But yeah, so to wrap it up freely? To wrap it up freely is just thoughts. focus on health, healing and fitness. Don't focus on the scales. You know, don't ever calorie restrict ever again. This is a lifestyle for life. This is not a diet. This is not a weight loss diet for the summer. So you can just go like this and then go like that later on. No, no, no. This is about the lifestyle long term. It will work if you stick to it. Listen to the lean, fit, healthy people. We're not starving. We're going to go out to dinner tonight. We're going to have fucking Indian vegan food. We're going to eat. We're going to fucking feast. Life really says don't focus on the weight. Focus We're on being a better person. Feast. Focus on helping the planet, the animals, yourself, people around you. Focus on so much fucking energy. You've got energy to give. That's my, that's my closing thoughts. That's right. And if you want to hear more fucks, go to June Rider's channel. Fuck on earth. Okay, so here we are at dinner. We're at an Indian buffet and we've got some rice here. I think it's like basmati what they usually use. And this is only a $10 buffet, super, super cheap. We've got this dal dish here and there's a tofu bean dish. And that's a bit of a spicy dish, that one. This is all vegan. We've got salad, organic greens, and some sauce there. This is my bowl. This is one of my bowls. So I had a couple of bowls. And as you can see, it's loaded with greens on top. I really, we really love the greens from here. They're beautiful, very tender. So we load up on them and that's it, yeah. Very, very tasty and only $10, so super, super cheap. So that's it, Fruit Bats. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and have a fantastic weekend. Don't forget to go fruit or root yourself, and I'll see you on Monday. Are you living the daydream yet? Are you living the daydream? Are you living the daydream now? You say you have a shaking faith. Try and cover up your face I don't want to watch you die So listen up and start to fly Locked behind
behind a gate Inside a house you can't escape They will carry you with hands above To a place you'll finally love Thank you.